Two aliens sit at a table in a crowded space bar near the galactic rim. They eye a lone, frail-looking creature drinking in the corner. What the fuck is that thing? They call it a human. What an awkward, strange-looking body. It is totally creepy. What's it taste like? Better not fuck with it. That species is rated class one on the danger scale. Surely you jest. It, it is so weak looking. Can it regenerate? Are its bones and flesh natural carbon fiber? Robotic muscular assistance? Nanobots? No, it doesn't have any of that. Its bones are just calcium, I think. Then I will eat it, for I hunger greatly for flesh and fight. You will die. The bulky Zeno laughs off its companion's warning. A half ton of hydraulic muscles and thick, dense exoskeleton cause the floor to creak as it stands. Aliens of all shapes and forms scatter to make room for this striding behemoth of power and violence as it walks across the bar to the small, soft, human creature in the corner. The Xeno begins clicking its razor-sharp diamond mandibles. The human cell phone translates. Thin calcium structure surrounded by soft water tissue. You cut it, it bleeds. It bleeds, it dies. So easy. I do not fear this creature. Another one. I came to consume ethanol and acquire inebriation. I did not come to fight. I am impressed. Ethanol is a potent poison. For nine credits a glass, it had better well damn be. I will need to filter this poison from your blood before I consume your body. That's just what a little bitch would say. The Xeno scuttles forward rapidly towards his prey. Four razor claws cock back in preparation for the kill. Launching his claws forward in a blur of speed to impale its prey, the Xeno suddenly stumbles as it passes through the human. There is nothing there. A hologram. A trick. The man jumps down from the ceiling, an impossible climb, and calmly plants an explosive penetration mine on the Xeno's exposed back. The man steps back and detonates the trigger without hesitation. A muffled explosion as a diamond rod propelled by hot plasma penetrates the Xeno's exoskeleton with enough force to crack the alien in half. The human leans forwards towards the burning corpse to light a flame a small stick of dry plant material. Stopping to examine casually the carnage, he inhales a cloud of carcinogenic smoke from his plant stick. His lips turn upward at the corners, teeth exposed, as he turns to face the frightened, staring crowd. Clean up in aisle six, he says, followed by a violent eruption of barking noises from his open mouth. The aliens do not understand, but many leave the bar in frightened response. They have witnessed the madness and violent sneakiness of that foul creature known as man, and they consider themselves lucky to have survived.